What options do couples have when proceeding with a divorce in Utah? Attorney Peter Curran explains. There are two general types of divorces, contested and uncontested. A contested divorce means there are certain things that you do not agree on, and you are going to have to have a judge decide instead of deciding together. Very few cases that start as contested divorces continue to trial, which means at some point, the contested divorce becomes an uncontested divorce and the parties bring a joint proposal to the court for its approval. In certain cases, that agreement already exists at the beginning of the divorce. The parties both agree on how they should divide their marital assets and untangle their lives from each other, and they are able to submit that to the court in a way that does not require any additional determination. Whenever you file a petition with the court, you are filing a wish list. You are telling the court what it is you would like. In a contested divorce, you can do that without any concern about the other party. They are going to be able to answer it, and they are going to be able to tell the court what they would rather have. In an uncontested divorce, one person still has to file, and they can file their wishes, but at this point, they have drafted a petition that both parties are comfortable and agree with. The respondent, rather than filing an answer and challenging the petition, can simply file an acceptance and a waiver and allow the divorce to proceed according to the terms that are in the petition. Alternatively, a couple can file a temporary separation in Utah where they can have orders that would govern alimony, personal property, custody, and child support. That would only last for one year. At any time during that year, either party can roll that into a divorce case. Call now to schedule your free consultation or visit our website at www.peterkern.lawyer.